Oscar. Time for Daddy to go to work. We got another pickup near the old farmhouse in the Santiatsky Mountains. Spin up! Play out for the Azteca. Or maybe they should keep an eye out for me. Pick up. I could say the same for my visitors. What's the draw? Oh, something different, something different. The Aztecas have become a problem again trying to lure a couple of our customers. The plane's been rigged with bombs. Well, I say we hit back now. Take out a few of their bases and remind them who they're fucking with. Loud and clear, amigo! If there's one thing Trevor Phillips Industries prides itself on, it's fair competition in the marketplace. Target. 
Fuck. Flying Air Phillips. This is your captain speaking. You might have noticed some turbulence during the recent bombings, but we're expecting a smooth run in. So sit back and enjoy the flight. <laughs> I like you, Trevor. You're just crazy enough. I agree. That should keep your fellow countrymen out of our way, don't you think? For now. There's always more where they came from. Yeah, I've been having similar issues with some bikers. They all get the message eventually. I wouldn't have called if it wasn't a crisis, Doc. All right, I'll see you at our next session. Isaiah Friedlander speaking. Hey, Doc, it's me. Michael, how are you? Not good, Doc. Not good at all. Well, we spent a lot of time over the years discussing how negative actions lead to negative thoughts as much as the reverse. Because of the compounding of your classical low self-esteem with your 
assorted sexual hang-ups, the desperate search for the easy answer in life, and your profound narcissism, reality will have a habit of handing you a repeated kicking. Anyway, what's up? Hell, Doc, when you put it like that, I'm afraid I ain't got much hope. Have you been acting out again, Michael? I've been a mixed bag, Doc. Tell me about the problem behaviors. Okay, well, things are... I gotta tell you, Doc, they're off. I'm making bad decisions here. And other people are picking up the tab for it. My family left me, but they won't even take my phone calls. But, but I did meet this guy, Solomon Richards. You might have heard of him. Richard's Majestic, and we're doing some work together <laughs> in the movies. Can you fucking believe that? I'm a movie producer. Well, I'm glad to hear things are looking up. But you shouldn't look for validation outside of yourself. Validation isn't a label. It comes from within. Any other violent outburst, Michael? I've been out of control, Doc. I think I got, you know, an imbalance or something. You know, I mean, one minute I'm one person, and the next minute I'm another person. And you sometimes feel you're not responsible for your actions. It's all denial. Yeah, it's easy for you to judge, Doc. I had a tough childhood. Hmm. What about your sexual problems, Michael? I've been well. I mean, I've had thoughts, but I've been good. <sighs> not a single problem. We all have thoughts, Michael. Not acting on them is real progress. Ever since I pulled that fucking house off that fucking hill, my fucking life has been fucking fucked. You know, therapy can really help you, Michael, which is why you should be really pleased with what you're doing. But I'm gonna have to stop you there. Oh, and there is one thing. Phone sessions are a little more expensive, obviously. Obviously. But so fulfilling. Let's speak again soon.
truck, huh? Yeah, fuck it, why not? Take me to my father, father, brother, uncle, Kiflum. Yo, peace, brother, brother. Kiflum. Oh, Kiflum. really? Oh! Is that steaming pile of shit a present for not training you? Hey, Bev! Oh, man, you fucking ruined the shot! You ruined the fucking shot! What the fuck you talking about? You ruined the fucking shot! It's a fucking reality show, and you ruined it, homie. Homie's got you them photos. Poppy Mitchell, the English princess, the others. Oh, right, man, you know? <laughs> Don't even remember, right? The whole thing is like... But what about my money? We're shooting a show here, trying to work. Hello? I'll just, you know, have somebody call my agent or something. Man, fuck you. Whatever. Uh, back to one. Please, we're shooting something. Uh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Now where, now, where were we? Uh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Now, where, now, where were we?
Oh, crap. That hurt.
High ground! Good thinking, T. Listen, even your parents can't stand you. Go home, man. Why, oh, why weren't you drowned at birth? Holy shit. Devin Weston sent me. Oh, oh, right. Uh, the helipad is on the roof. You pissed off the wrong officer. What are you gonna do to me? 
I think I'm gonna fix your attitude. Please, please, take it easy. You the ride along? Get on board! Ride along? Sure! Let's go! Boot up the scanner thing. It can pick up those new ID cards, right? When it's on, just fly where I point. Okay, booting up! You can use the stick to move the camera. Zoom in and out. It'll pick up pedestrians carrying the 2012 SA State License. If you target them, the scanner accesses the database and pulls their record. Ah. I got a pal on the ground we're gonna go see. So hey, you researching a movie? Or TV? You're a screenwriter, right? Mm, not exactly. An actor? Kinda smells like you're researching a role. Hey, buddy, look, I got a confession, okay? I'm not an actor or a writer. Or the son of a bigwig. I'm a criminal and your boss has kind of sold you to me. Sold me? I'm afraid so. Like chattel. Huh? Now we got that clear, you need to know we're looking for a high-value automobile. Once we find it, my guy in the ground will jack it, and we're gravy. So, um, uh, and then? And then what's happening? And then? Ah, spoiler alert, kid. We kill the witness. Yikes. Me? Don't sweat. The dying ain't the hard part. The hard part is the ground you're hitting at terminal velocity. Right, right! There he is, over by the oil derricks. Let's see if we can scan him.
car might be worth something, but it ain't. It's, it ain't got no resale. Zilch. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's yours, man. Enjoy! I mean, that car's a bit flashy for my taste. Just take it and chill out. Be mellow. Relax. I'm just gonna get out of your way. Suspect down! Fine work, ground unit. Mr. Clinton. Hey, Ma, right? I got that car for y'all. The Z-Type? Mr. Weston will be glad you caught us. 
He wanted to see it before we took off. We're on the way to his personal hangar at Los Santos International. I'll tell them to expect you at the gate. All right. Hey, I'm supposed to meet Devin Weston here. Mr. Weston's hangar is up there on the left. Oh, there she is. <laughs> you know, if this beauty was a woman, I'd have to break my 20 and under rule. Man, I'll just stick to <laughs> driving, all right? Hey, tell me something. You know how many of these things they made? Uh, shit, like 10? No, not like 10, man. Exactly 10. Oh, wow, man. You one of them type of dudes, huh? Tell you something. How'd you like to drive a car like this one day, man? For real. Like this? Or this? Oh, man, right back at me, homie. Really nice. Hey, you know something? You're not like those, uh, snowbird retiree pals of yours. You are sharp, man. Man, I'm just looking for a paycheck for my services. No, no, don't worry. It'll come. That'll come. But right now, it is life lesson time, pal. You have got to wake up to what's real in this situation, bro. Take me, right? I am opportunity. I'm security. I'm fast cars, blow jobs. I got the world on a plate. Those two clowns, oh, man, they are the worst kind of disaster that can ever come down. They are a full core meltdown, and you're just standing there soaking up major radiation. You have got to take stock, man. Make that call before it's too late. Yeah, all right, man, I will. Before it's too late, man. Yeah, uh, yeah. Just take any car and go.
and shine, Chop Chop. Thank <laughs> you. 